Hello, Hello Internet. Internet! Welcome to another episode of Aqua Mafia Watches Gravity Falls. I'm Jesse. I'm Golden. I'm Frankie. Today we're watching Season 2, Episode 10, Northwest Mansion Mystery. Mm. Pacifica episode. <laughs> Northwest Mansion Mystery. Ooh, haunted. Ooh. A haunting exorcism. Possession. Bill Cipher. <laughs> mm. <laughs> um... I don't know. Maybe she does something to upset Mabel and Mabel decides to break in. And then they get lost. It's a maze. I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to go with a haunting and they, like, Mabel doesn't want to go rescue her, but they're like, ah, we got to, or something like that. That's where I'm leaning on. <laughs> no, I want to be a good person! <laughs> you know what? I'm down. I'm down. Okay. That's, that's, the, that's your guess. That's our, yep. Yeah, Mabel okay. just wants Collective to be a good guess. person, even though she doesn't want to be a good person. <laughs> okay. Well, why don't we watch and find out? But first, you at home, this is not a market substitute. Watch the actual thing through legal means. Spend money to watch this episode before we watch it. This is, a, in my opinion, a really good episode. So be sure to make sure that you watch it before you make sure that we watch it right now by watching <laughs> us watch it. Am I clear? Watch <laughs> I feel me. like I'm being crystal clear here. Yeah. Sure. You don't got it by now. <laughs> All right, let's watch. Quick, or no, Mugukin. No, Mugukin. Okay, okay. I, right. <laughs> I must say, the guest list for this year's party has so much diversity. Yes, a nice mix of millionaires and billionaires. <laughs> Put the oyster fork at an angle. We're not animals, man. <laughs> the theme is sea foam green, not lake foam green. Go change. But I, I kind of like it. Mind your mother, Pacifica. But... Yes, father. What? <laughs> Uh, haunting! Oh, no. It's happening. You are my possessions! Obey me! Wait, how did he do that? This is a disaster! The party's in just 24 hours! Surely there's someone who could handle this sort of nonsense? And I think I know just the person. Tipper! <laughs> <laughs> the cops were like, ah! Oh. Vampire man, that's huge! So. It is a haunting of some yes. sort. <laughs> and they want Dipper to help. Oh, uh, yes. And that intro was shorter than usual. Your Pacifica Northwest is the worst. And that's not just jealousy talking. I'd say that to her face. I need your help. You're the worst. <laughs> <laughs> but there's something haunting Northwest Manor. If you don't help me, the party could be ruined. And why should I trust you? All you've ever done is try to humiliate me and Mabel. Just name your price, okay? I'll give you anything. Hi, Pacifica! <laughs> Excuse us. I'll bust your goats. But, in exchange, I'll need three tickets to the party. Mm -hmm. You're just lucky I'm desperate. Just has them. Desperate! 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 Drink us, get the glue gun. We're making dresses! <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Northwest Manor, dorks. You look so stuck. Greta's outfit is actually so fancy. Fancy super nice. Fancy plants. <gasps> fancy man! Yes, very good, miss. <laughs> you know, one or two? Check out this party! Marius von Fondhauser. He's a baron from Austria. Forget the quail, I'm putting him in my guest basket. Hold up, lady. I can't believe I'm gonna say this, but I think this boy is out of our league. Greta is right. He's a white whale. Hunting him will destroy us. There are tons of people. <laughs> Yeah, this looks like the kind of room that would be haunted, all right. I wouldn't be worried, though. Ghosts fall on a ten-category scale. Floating plates sound like a category one. <laughs> so what? Are you going to bore him back into the afterlife by reading from this book? Just gotta splash this sucker with some anointed water, and he should be out of your probably fake blonde hair. What was that about my hair? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, my 
Even though he's a bad guy. <laughs> Welcome, dukes and duchesses, sultans and sportsmen, and reclusive 102-year-old mayor of Gravity Falls, Mayor Bifuftelfunter. <laughs> Let's 
parents are pussy. Parents are You want me to let in the townsfolk? Because I'll do it. Just change everyone back. You wish to prove yourself? Pull that lever and open the grand gate to the town. Fulfill your ancestors' promise. The Pacifica and East Northwest. Stop this instant! I'm coming to the panic room. There's enough mini sandwiches and oxygen to last you, me, and a butler for a week. We'll eat the butler. <laughs> <laughs> you dare disobey us? What is with the bell? Is this bell broken? <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, it's happening. My heart, once as hard as oak, now grows soft like more of a birch or something. <laughs> Pacifica, you are not like the other Northwests. I feel lumber justice. <laughs> 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 oh, here you go. Oh, yes, sir! Good lord, the riprap! They're everywhere! <laughs> oh, there's Mika Kidneys! Don't go! Why was he I up there? Must, I must speak with you. There's something about you. I can't get you out of my head. You're so bold and confident. I know you're probably out of my league, but might I give you my phone number? I don't have a phone! Write it on my face! Whoa, Gosh. go Brenda! <laughs> 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 oh my god. Dipper, I've been looking for you. I fixed the laptop. I've been doing calculations and I think something terrible is coming. The apocalypse! The end times! You know what, McGucket? How about we talk about this stuff tomorrow? It's a party. Oh, this is bad! <laughs> Something's coming! Something big! Oh. In here, my darling. They're seeing activity on the machine. It's go time. Where's my phone? I don't have it. Yes, you do. It was in your purse. Oh, so I'm just supposed to hold on to everything for you? <laughs> I asked you when we were in the car. Why do we always have to fight at parties? <laughs> Not even gonna ask. <laughs> <laughs> Northwest Mansion Mystery. What'd you guys think? So they're aligned with Bill Cipher, or their family used to praise, worship him? Align themselves to him? Maybe. Maybe. It could just be a valuable artifact that they own. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, that's true. Because Bill's been around in human history for since the beginning of human history. So, mm-hmm. not necessarily means they're aligned with him. It is a uh, bad omen, though. But uh, let, let's start with uh, Sorry, some stuff yeah. in the actual episode. Uh, <laughs> so we got a lot more character development for Pacifica. Mm-hmm. We found out why she is the way she is. Yeah. Her parents, parents are actually super abusive. Yes. They somehow trained her with a bell. Yeah. Like a, like she's a pet. Like yeah. a... Is it Pavlov's dog? A Pavlov's yes. dog. Yes. Yeah. 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 Condition, Pavlovian yeah. Uh, conditioning. So that uh, she'll... Whenever, she'll just stop whenever stop. they ring yeah. the bell. Uh, which is... Terrible. Yeah, th- yeah. What did they have to do to like? Yeah, never. Mind. I won't even get into yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But um, what was, a, what was I gonna say about that? Was a weird. I didn't see the the whole uh, Pacifica and Dipper kind of. Oh, the interest. They, they might be interested in I was each like, other. Uh, interesting. Okay. Okay. I'm not. I'm not mad. Because she's. <laughs> oh. He's always hated her because of how she treats his sister. Yeah. <laughs> but then they kind of buried the hatchet a little bit. But he still doesn't like her as a person. But then he learns more about her, and they had that hug, mm-hmm. and she was actually happy to see him come back to the party, yeah. even though he was pissed off. Yeah. Uh, so yes, there may be something there. Okay. It's too. It's too early. Yeah, I mean, they just. Side. I think they just started seeing each other as. Oh, you're actually not bad. Yeah. yeah. And it's kind of. Yeah. Also, the the uh, Grinda and what was his actual name? Hans Baron Marius. Marius, I think. I keep wanting you to say Hans Gruber, but I'm like, no, Frozen. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, Marius. 
Was his name Hans Gruber? Because Hans Gruber was the bad guy from Die Hard. No, wait. <laughs> no, I'm mixing up some. I, he was a Hans, though. Yes. Yes. Hans, I think it's Sorry, just known and as Hans. Sorry, then I just went to Gruber. Different. Yeah. <laughs> what were we talking about? Oh, yes. Uh, uh, was I Marius or Darius? Have, I forget. Yes. I love that they have a hidden room behind the painting where they, like, you know, stashed all the family history. Yeah. And I love that their panic room is right directly beneath the floorboards. <laughs> it might have a bunch of entrances. I don't know. But uh, <laughs> we have enough food and oxygen to last, to last you, me, and a butler for a week. We'll eat the butler. <laughs> <laughs> the butler just didn't even react. Just, so I'm going. Very, very good, man. <laughs> <laughs> He's a very good butler. <laughs> just with infinite patience. Yeah. <laughs> they make the butler shake Dipper's yeah. hand. <laughs> so we can't possibly thank you enough. That's enough. That's enough. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, but yes, Dipper got to show off some of his skills this episode, you yeah. know, uh, he caught a level 10 ghost, Yeah, wonder how, then escaped. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder if that's like, like, that whole mythos about silver mirrors, hmm. that comes from anything else? Probably. Uh, the, creator sure, the creator of the show, Alex Hirsch, loves that stuff, so I'm sure he did actually do research and stuff, and actual ghost things. I mean, he made it more goofy in this, obviously, yeah. but uh, but I think the silver silver mirror thing is an actual thing. Have one last look at the trees. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man, go nuts. <laughs> <laughs> yes, lumberjack justice. Lumber <laughs> justice. Lumber justice. So uh, here's a little tidbit that they mention in uh, this here journal. Uh, the Mudslides caused by the uh, lack of lumber used to make the actual mansion. Mm-hmm. Uh, you see all those little graves of people who died making the mansion. Mm-hmm. Though the uh, mudslides actually moved a lot of the bodies down, under, and around the mystery shack. That's why when oh. the zombies came up, there were all the bodies there. Oh, wow, okay. Oh, that's Whoa. so... Those were the lumberjacks who died making Jeez. the mansion. Oof. That's so that's dark. Good. I don't know if that was like an afterthought or that was... Because it is weird that all those bodies just came up in the middle yeah. of the woods. Yeah, actually. But it also makes sense because it's the middle of the woods. I would expect a lot of people to accidentally die there or be buried there, you know. But uh, they're specifically were from the graveyard, the makeshift graveyard, graveyard that used to surround uh, the mansion. That was moved by the mudslides. Wild. Yeah. Whew. Yeah, and the journal mentions the mudslides a lot because it's a very uh, big thing that happens in the history of Gravity Falls. That A lot of stuff are tied to that. And they and they, they spell that more in the book than they ever did on the show, because mm-hmm. they never even hint at that in the show, other than the mudslides being mentioned is how that one guy died. Uh, the lumberjack, who I think, I don't know if it was ever confirmed, but I think it's fan theory that he's uh, Wendy's great 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 grandfather. I can see that. Yeah. Because the, the I mean, look at that beard. His beard was gray, yeah. but it was like a, re- a reddish gray. And when it first appeared, it was like red fire, and then it turned blue. So he yeah. probably was uh, Manly Dan's ancestor. Yeah, but also, like, you know, his wife or whatever in the, in, later down the line could have been a redhead somewhere. That's true, too. And, yeah. Yeah. It's a lot little, little things. And McGucket, like, he's kind of faking the yeah. prospector because he's like, yeah. horrible things are coming. Yeah. yeah. So they got 21 hours before the apocalypse. And apparently the the agents are also aware of this. We've got a lot of episodes left, and something bad happens, right? <laughs> Jeez. Well, this is halfway through season two, so. <coughs> so each, they're, they, bringing, they're bringing each episode up. today. <laughs> like, I mean, yeah, the next episode's gonna be the next day after this party. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So we have nine, ten, oh, ten more episodes to conclude this. I don't know what the term is. I want to say Pipper? Dasifica? Dipsifica? Oh, you're talking about couple names? <laughs> there are some diehards uh, for uh, the, Dipper, the Pacifica, parents. and then and Wendy and, and Dipper. I did see an animation that was weird. Oh, no, it wasn't. It was an animation of, like, sibling love of, like... Oh, it was, like, it was Dipper and Mabel... Uh-huh. But it, it turned out to be uh, Grenda making a fan fiction, and like uh, Candy was like, 
like I don't think that's right <laughs> and like we're just like oh no I love it like yeah it was a weird animation thing I saw on like Facebook it was a, probably a fan thing yeah. I'm guessing yeah. 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 yeah but like when I was first watching it it was like showing this like weird like kind of scene between Dipper and Mabel and I was like ugh ugh and, but you can't stop watching you're like ugh and then like it pans out and it's like uh, Mabel and Candy talking and she got a fan fiction book and like it's like wow I suppose there are Mabel Dipper fans too, but we don't talk about that. I like Pacifica. <laughs> Those are the weird ones, like. though. With the you, you like Pacifica and Dipper? No, I like Pacifica. Yeah, oh, that's, that's it. Pacifica. Pacifica versus. I'm down with Pacifica. Pepper. Pepper. Pepper just seems too odd. Yeah, Pepper or yeah. Pepper. Yeah. It sounds too much like an actual name. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Dip Pacifica, I think, is a better name. I, I assume that's what it is because it does roll the tongue better, yeah. as opposed to. Wepper? <laughs> but what's her... Their Di- last name is Pines, right? Yeah, Pines. So you could do North Pines? North Pines. Dipisa? Dipisa. Eh, I like Dipsifica. Mm. I still don't know his real name. Anyway. Yeah. I do, because it's in this book. <laughs> yeah. Didn't you tell us? No. I, told, I gave you a hint. I that, thought he told us. No. Uh, so it's an M. All we, no, all we, we found out that we know why that he's called Dipper yeah, because of the birth constellation. Birth. I told you that, that the thing Alex Hirsch always said was, it's it's a name that matches Mabel's because they're twins. The implication right. being that it starts with an M or has something to do with trees. All right, birch maybe oak. <laughs> Mabel and oak. <laughs> 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 All right. Well, if you know Mary. Dipper's real name, don't put it in the comments because it's a, it's not really a spoiler. But I don't, I, I'm going to reveal it to these guys eventually. We, we actually read those. Yeah. I yeah. Asked, okay, so I recently found out I ruined this series for myself before I even watched the series. So. Oh, don't ruin it for us. <laughs> so yeah, keep so that, I'm already on that. Keep like, that quiet. Let me. <laughs> but uh, in the comments down below, let us know your one true pair from this series. It could be any two characters. <laughs> That you think are like, yeah, this relationship's the best one on the show, or should be. Uh, there, there's Waddles and, and the goat. I'm starting to grow on me, but oh, for me, it'd be Susan and. Um, Melody? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, they're good. They're solid. Oh, there's any diehard. No, Giffany and Seuss. <laughs> I want those two to get back together. I wonder if there'd be a matchup between, like, the gnomes and Giffany. They're obsessed, and they're never yeah, gonna, Yeah, like, but they live in the forest without technology. They can get a computer, an <laughs> iPad. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> they can make it work. <laughs> someone, someone, someone make this happen. So, I would like to read it. Someone out there. Or watch it, just to see what the hell you do. <laughs> We're ending it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Internet! Things got weird, and that was really hot.